We also have over here a presentation that explains the full process, so anybody who needs to understand the ideas behind. But what we want to do most of all is invite you to participate. So please come over here. Thank you. This is very exciting. It's like a garden that I'm stepping so, into. No, you can't step in yet because first there's something for you to do. Which is? You have to choose a fruit from the tree which is a question that you think is interesting and you think you might have an interesting response to. So please look at the fruit and choose one. Okay, I'm actually seeing one really interesting here. Um, which, can I, can I read it? It says, um, what do you hate about children? <laughs> You don't have to give me your answer yet, but I'm going to invite you to come inside and we're going to tell a story together and then we're going to see whether we can come up with some ideas of how to respond to that story. Okay? Okay. Wow. Hello everybody. Please come and sit down. Find a comfortable place to sit. Yes? This is, a, this is supposed to be for me, but I'm afraid it's a little too small for my head. So, now there's only one rule for sitting down here, is that anybody who wants to see needs to hold the flower. That's the only rule. Otherwise, you can say anything you like, and you can respond any way you like. And so what we'd like to start is to invite you or somebody else to read out that question and tell us something about your response to that question. So would you like to do that? Of course. So I'm holding the flower and I will say again, what do you hate about children? Um, I hate children when they scream. Okay, so now we're going to tell a shared story. Anybody who likes to add to that story has to say yes and, and they will take the flower. So anybody like to continue from the story? Yes, and I hate noise. Okay, who would like to continue? Someone else like to continue? No? Okay, and yes, and I also love children sometimes, because sometimes the noise is pleasant. Yes, I like children because they are imaginative. Yes, and the echo of the screen goes far, so everyone can hear the children. Anybody else? Okay, oh yes. Yes, just like our world, noise around in our background. Any more? <laughs> yes, you want to say something more? Can I ask another question? Well, well I'm, I'm going to ask everybody now to tell us, perhaps offer something that they learned from that story. So was there something that you learned about children and hating children from the story that we talked about? It's okay to sometimes hate children. It was quite liberating to say it out loud. <laughs> Anybody else have anything that they think they learned from our story? That also children has a voice that can reach very far. Okay, so we I think you want to tell a little bit about that system of story? So maybe I start to think that because what you said. Maybe in our society we need to say out more things and so we will need spaces where to really sincerely say out loud those difficult things. And I think that today this space would be one of those. Okay, that's great. I think we've learned quite a few lessons. What we would do normally next is invite everybody to take a seat out of the pot. Would you like to take a seat? Everybody else can see? We won't make you to wait too much longer. Okay, so I'll just explain a little bit and then I'll let you go on. Okay? 
So normally the idea now is you pull out a C, which is meant to help you come up with an interesting response to our story. So perhaps we won't go all the way around it, but invite you to respond. Read out your, your C and tell us what you think. Okay, it says most expensive solution. So, so what do you think might be the most expensive solution for noisy children? Economically? Money-wise? Whatever way you think. Um, to make many children. <laughs> <laughs> That's a very good answer. answer. So, the idea is that we go around it, all kinds of things to match into the responses, and then this is the first phase of our process, the next stage, we try and find somebody who wants to in a shared model uh, which idea they would like to find. So if you like to know some more, actually you can watch our animation and learn a little bit more about explosion. I will definitely do it later on today. And please, everybody, come and look at this. It's quite exciting. Thank you. John, well done. Great. <laughs> and the next group that I will step into would be the ESF. The Kingston Society of Well, what we discussed is that the actors created new collaboration and networking models. Hello. Hello. The topic of our case group has been uh, the European Structural Fund and from a project point of view, uh, we have been focusing on how to change the mindset into that the projects and 